Good morning, everyone. Mold and mildew and other things that are bad for us tend to grow and develop in dark and damp places. And in order to get rid of this growth, it's necessary to open up the area and bring light, sunlight, and fresh air. Plants, when sitting in darkness, wither and die, but when given enough water and full sunshine, are restored to full health. In the gospel today, the image of light is prominent. In the same way that light destroys the mold and mildew, in the same way that light restores the health of plants, the true light of the world destroys death and restores life. If we want to benefit from this great gift, it requires something of us. It requires that we move into that light, the light of Christ. It requires that we show our wounds, festering or not, to the divine physician. It requires that we too know and look at these wounds that are ailing us because we can't call on the divine physician if we don't know that we're sick. And so we have to expose ourselves to the light, to the light of Christ. That means reflecting on our lives, looking over our sins and our good, good points too, but paying attention to the sins and bringing a light to them going to confession regularly so that the light and the divine physician can get to work. 